Good morning, everyone. So today I am trying this buff on my hair. Um, I actually slept on it and it was, of course, with dry hair. Um, my curls were already nice and defined and looking good and I wanted to see if this would help kind of protect them overnight. Waking up this morning, I feel like it's a little funny looking. I guess it's funny no matter what, but um, it stayed on pretty good. I got just a few hairs that came loose here and it slid up just a little bit on my head. I like to be able to um, put it behind my ears without having lots of pressure on my ears and it's nice and thin. Um, didn't make me hot and it stayed on nice and tight. Uh, and then this part here, I just tucked in. So when I'm done um, taking this off and showing you what it looks like and everything, I'll show you how to put it back on. <laughs> And then later today, I'll get some more footage of um, what my hair looks like after it rests and comes down and stuff. So basically, it's just a long tube. And it's a type of a scarf, actually. You may have seen these before. It's just a tube. And then once you get it on your hair, you can just take it off really easily. Um, it's going to seem kind of tight and lumped together, so I'm just going to shake it around a little bit. and just loosen the roots a little. And then flip back. And you can see that it's sticking out just a little bit still at my neck, but it's not squashed up here, so that's nice. And then I'm going to shake it to help kind of re relax it down. It feels like it's sticking way out on the back of my head. Well, that's all right. It'll relax. So later on, once it relaxes a bit, oh, this one's a little wonky. I might have had a little bit of water on that curl. Uh, couple strands were slightly damp. Yeah, like this one got just a little flattened right there. Yeah, I don't know if it's because they were a tiny bit damp. I actually sort of refreshed my hair just a little bit before I went to bed and then um, I was like, oh, we'll see what happens if I just have a couple little damp pieces, but, but not bad. So uh, pretty fun, huh? You can see that that works to keep the, the volume and, um, I don't, I don't know. I have a little tiny bit of frizz maybe, but you know, if I was to wear that most nights and in the morning, just spend a little time touching up a couple curls, that would be really nice. <laughs> All right. So let me show you how to get this back on your head. Uh, this is actually a name brand, Buff. So you may have seen these before. I'm pretty sure these are in my Amazon store. So um, you can go to my affiliate uh, shop page on Amazon. And you know, if you wanna get one of these, use my link. All right, so you just put it into a loop and go around your chin. And then you do just like you're going to pineapple your hair, flip your hair down, get this up to your forehead, and then just make sure you have the end here, and then just pull it up. And then you look like Marge Simpson. <laughs> if you have really long hair, it might stick out, but you do have some more space to go. You have quite a lot here. So you could really use this with long hair <laughs> and you can wear it as far down as you want. You can sleep with it to cover your eyes. <laughs> but for me, I just kind of scrunch it right here on my forehead so that it doesn't put too much pressure on my actual hair uh, and then up over my ears. And then you can kind of flip this wherever you want or you can tuck it in. 
Now I had thought that you could maybe use it almost like a, a scrunch. You know, you can kind of scrunch your hair up almost like you're plopping. So I, I think that might work. But remember that when you plop with your roots straight up all along here, especially with wet hair, it's gonna make that go straight. So this is, you know, only for dry hair really. Um, but to keep your curls tight and intact, you could scrunch this down as well. Um, you could use um, a ribbon or something to kind of go around to help hold that in place, but I'm not worried about it. It seemed to keep the curl pretty well, just the way I did it. So, and then like I said, I make sure that the tight part here that's scrunched up is on my forehead instead of up on my hair so I don't get flat roots. And you know, I wanted to see if it made me get a wrinkled forehead and I really don't think it did, which is amazing, right? Because when your skin starts to get just a little bit older, if you get those lines from sleeping on your pillow and stuff, they'll be there for like six, eight hours or longer. The rest of the day, you're just like, oh no, you know? So it's wonderful when you don't get that. And this is a nice soft material. So I'm so excited. All right, guys. Let me know if you have any questions and remember to go check it out in my Amazon affiliate store. Talk to you later. Bye.